Yo, what's good, guys? I am back. <coughs> I'm currently still sick, trying to recover. But today, something special happened, and I wanted to take this opinion to react there to get um, my thoughts out for you guys to let you know my opinion on the whole situation. So what we have here today is beef, pain, and netto. There was something going behind the scenes, probably. There were just something happened, and uh, pain felt the need to talk about it. I didn't mention Nato specifically, but Nato made a response video, and that's why I'm referring now to Nato instead of like an anonymous content creator at this point, because it's <coughs> that's for that. And yeah, in case some people might ask, I DM Pain was talking to him, asking if it's cool with him if I react to his video. He said, "Yo, go react to it. It's completely fine." There you go. Just to let you know in advance. And without me yapping too much, let's jump right into it. I also try not to edit too much out of the video. I want to have it as raw as possible. Uh, let's just dive in, react to Payne here, what he has to say. And then we jump over to Neto's respond video. And while watching these two videos, I'm just giving my thoughts. I don't know how long this video will be. Could be 50 minutes, could be 30 minutes video. I don't know. Whatever it is, but I remember you guys really liked the last time I shared my opinion with the community so here i am back with another one thing can't even tell anymore <clears throat> uh that seems to have a little bit of a vendetta against their own peers so let, let me let me start this off by saying this um what you see with me what you see with my boy zaf is our own hands oh yeah just, just in case uh, in case you're wondering i already watched Payne's video but i'm just going through it with you guys together so I think around here he's starting. It's I think. raw. It's never edited. It's me. There's something around it's here. There's something around it's here. It's me. Raw. So what he's saying here, he's, he's just telling everybody, I am playing the game. That's what he's saying. And here live. Or just not edit. Okay? That goes for a lot of my peers. A lot of my peers put a lot of effort into the games. All right? This is our own sweat, blood, and tears. This is our own testing. This is our own... Passion going into some of us though. <coughs> sorry do guys. Sorry. No, 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 no. Because they're 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 too busy taking other people's content, paying for other people to play for them, and then claiming it for themselves, and then talking <laughs> shit about their peers as if they're better. Oh, can you imagine that? Can you imagine paying somebody to play for 20 hours for you an obscene amount of money? 10 15 people on your account doing it on a daily basis and then you have the audacity to claim that it's your strategy and it's your gameplay ho, ho, ho. get the fuck out of here that is wild that the fact that okay so i i gotta stop here i want to pause it like in sections or something so basically what pain is saying that uh, neto is paying other players who are very good <coughs> at the game for her to record footage so she can upload it to her youtube channel and so that she has something to share with the people and then also act like she did it herself i'm not sure if it's an open secret i knew about that for four months five months already at this point like i always had my doubts at the back or in the back about yeah is she playing herself or not right and actually, I have proof here because, well, not proof, well, what's proof? But I was always on the fence if it was played by herself or if it was recorded. But then I saw one Battlefield of Time video and that was enough for me knowing, okay, yeah, that's, uh, that's just gameplay from someone else. Uh, here I want to show you real quick. Because I looked at it. So this was the world record Igris clear strategy. 24 seconds. Do you notice something? I just curious guys. If you notice something. Um, you, we all know Nato is uh, speaking English. Living somewhere in the Emirates. Something like that. Or wherever. Here's the thing. We all know how that account looked like. But if you look here. There's a Korean text. Now, when I saw that Korean text, I immediately knew, okay, no, that's not, that's not, either not her own account, either that, or a Korean is playing her account with just Korean language on it, just so that person understands things, because that person might not be good in English, so one or the other, but that was for me just uh, 
the closing fact that I knew at this point that uh, Nato is not recording her own gameplay footage. Somebody has the crazy, crazy thoughts in their head that they think that other people don't know the shit that's going on is a little wild. So this goes down to somebody who has just way too much money, way too much time and just needs to find <laughs> validation through everything they do. Can you imagine being so childish that you need to make stupid moves like, oh, let's let's demonetize my channel. Let's buy everyone a gift card. Let's buy the entire community. Oh, furthermore, let me go in and get and buy out all the leakers. Make sure that it's mine so I can get some form of validation and, and to be honest, some form of content. Because yeah, I mean, I noticed that as well, like with, with Alpha Leaker, for example, Alpha Leaker started only posting on uh, Nato's Discord and then exclusively on her channel. I knew at this point, yeah, that it was all just like, that there was an agreement in the back, like, yo, I let, post uh, on my stuff exclusively, you get a certain amount of money for it. And yeah, I mean, what is there really else to say? It's, uh, yeah, whatever. I have no personality of my own. I just realized. I don't speak in any live streams because I'm probably not the one playing the account. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Did anybody else realize that? I wonder. Hmm. Yeah, I knew. I mean, the thing is, we always thought like, oh, is it AI voice or not? It was. It is. She confirmed it even herself. That's also probably why there's like never audio on the live stream and stuff like that. And there's one thing because he mentioned it before. So now before I, before I talk about that, before I go too far into it, there's also something because he just mentioned about people playing for it, right? If you know, there's one specific person well known in the community, if you know, you know, who was back in the day, always free to play, always free to play. You saw like only an A3 West Wind, not even maxed out in level, very free to play, nothing there going on, right? And then someday you see that person playing on stream Nato's account. For quite some time doing like path destruction battlefield of time stuff like that like a lot of action happens on nato's account and then miraculously that free-to-play player someday <laughs> locked into his account showed his own account and everything was maxed out a10 yeah no <laughs> so i know what the deal was <coughs> uh what the deal was really about and that person said yeah no i always had that account was person was acting like yeah he didn't know or he a always had the money no he did not okay he did not i mean it's fine i can understand trying to lie about it to a certain degree because there was probably the agreement yo i'm spending the money on your account um i'm, ma I'm maxing out your entire account but you cannot talk openly about it or anything and this person was like cool i'm fine with that so <coughs> That's what happened there, but was never open about it that actually someone else spent on that particular account. If you know, you know. If not, I uh, don't want to mention that uh, person right here. But it's fine. At the end of the day, if you get that opportunity, might as well take it. Oh, wait, I need, I need to make some content. Oh, let me get some of my pro players. Shout out to a couple of you guys. You know who you are because I have mad love for you to do it with me because I don't know what the hell I'm actually talking about. I need a high score? Wait a second. I don't even know how to play this game. Let me let me hire a couple other people who are pro players behind the scenes and pay them. Yeah, that, that's what, what I just uh, mentioned, right? The amount of money to make sure I look good so everybody else thinks that I'm the one doing it. I mean, as I just said, I cannot even be mad at the other people because they're like, they, they probably got some really decent money or some packs, big packs going on. So it's like, yeah, obviously I record footage for you and then I get like, I don't know, blue gems worth 10k. Plus, 20k, Whoa. who knows? Can you believe that? <laughs> Can you believe that? It's crazy that some people would do that, huh? And then they would turn around and actually diss hardworking people for their efforts. Now, if you don't know what I'm talking about at the moment... What, 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 what did he say again? For their efforts. Sorry? And they would turn around and actually... But I need to go back here Can a little bit. Can you believe that? Can you believe that? It's crazy that some people would do that, huh? And then they would turn around and actually diss hardworking people for their efforts. Dissing hardworking people for their efforts. Huh. I see. Yeah, that's something that rubs me the wrong way. So, here, here is the thing, guys, okay? 
I, I need I need to go full camel. I need to go. Sorry, I have to say this here real quick. I need I have to go full camel for this one. So if you're not good at a game, that's one thing. If you have the money to buy gameplay footage to cover on your account on your YouTube channel, that's also fine. Now here's where it gets a little bit iffy. Now, obviously because you uploaded it, um, you could theoretically say, yo, this is gameplay from someone else. You could mention that. But the person doesn't do it. At the end of the day, whatever, that slight me, slightly just rubs me the wrong way. And not, not too much, but I can still understand that you act like that it is your own gameplay, even though it is not. Because you want to have it in your persona. Oh, gamer girl, very good in a game, spends a huge ton of money on a game, right? But where it gets dicey and what rubs me the completely wrong way is you cannot talk smack about other players for playing bad. Like, bruh, you're not even playing the game. You're not even playing the game. How can you smack talk other people and say like, oh, you're so bad, you're so bad. You're not even playing. Like, where are we here? Are we here in the NBA? Or are we the spectators watching the pros on the field? Like, and if someone misses a free or layup we're like oh you you're so trash you're so bad you're so bad oh clay thompson missed uh, zero out of 13 so bad just retire by the way go spurs go that is not the case we are not here that this is not the sports is something you can't do that like that this is something that rubs me the wrong way and then also acting like, oh that's my strategy stuff stuff like that you know what you can do all that little things you know by gameplay act like you did it yourself and everything but take a low profile with that, you know? Take a low profile, be a little humble, show a little bit of humility, gets you through life a lot easier. Can I say that? Now, if you don't know what I'm talking about at the moment, <clears throat> you probably do. But if you don't know what I'm talking about, this is, an, this is somebody's uh, that I, I try to have some form of civil relationship with. At first, I started off as a mutual relationship because we had the same mentality of growing a community and making sure that the game prospered and that people got good information all right yeah i remember as as f pain and nato did like a merge with the giveaways and then working on their service together but over time i realized there was something going on because they started like collapse like small collapse like one or two videos i'm not sure anymore but at some point it was like pain and nato were just like having a distance to each other. Like there, there was no collab anymore. There was nothing going on. I didn't like, I didn't pay any close attention to it. I'm staying out of drama as much as I can. And I'm not really in any drama because you know why? I don't care. <laughs> I don't really care at all. I don't give a damn guys. You know, you know me for, uh, for my viewers, for, for my regular viewers, you know me, if you're watching my streams, stuff like that. I don't care in the slightest. I only care about me and myself and obviously about the people who are watching my videos or my fellow subscribers. <laughs> As the game evolved, that person also evolved and I also evolved. I grew, they grew. The difference was I grew in a different fashion. I grew through a community. I grew through people who actually I cared about and I actually grew through my audience and, and us getting to know each other. Yeah, I'm also very organically grow right now from my Discord. Like when I first started recording solo leveling and rise videos on my Discord, there were like what 30, 40 people max, roughly 30, 40 people, something, nothing too big from old game this light I played. But over time, no, and, and there was nothing like not much talk really going on my Discord. But over time, with solo leveling, keep grinding, doing the content, learning, meeting new people, stuff like that, growing and stuff organically there's like over 200 people now on my discord and fairly actively talking a lot to each other it's so nice it's so cool everybody's so helpful nice we have a lot of friendly banter going on over there and like my discord got so active there are so many messages i don't even bother reading through all them like back in the days i was like oh new messages i read through every single thing but nowadays it's just too much i'm like oh Fuck this. I can't read everything. I don't have the time and patience. I, I read when, when I get pinged. I always respond to my, my pings. That's what I always do. 
but I can't just read through everything. <laughs> everything about each other, right? And that other individual grew through AI voicing, nobody knowing if they're a, a male or a female or if they... I still not 100% convinced about this nowadays. I feel like that other person, Kaisen or whatever his name was, not, not, was it Kaisen, Kaisar? Kai, I, who knows? I forgot. I think this is a real person. I'm not sure if it's, if not, it's that person or sorry. I don't care. You know what? I don't know. I don't know. Even who knows? People. It is. We don't know. Uh, growing through insane toxicity in their servers, uh, never speaking in any live streams, and still to this day, no. Yeah. Yeah, you never hear it. That's why I like it. There's always, I have that uh, gut feeling, like my, 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 my tingle feeling is telling me, yo, there are just too many red flags going on. You'll be like, ah, ah, too many questions, too many questions. Nobody knows who they are or what they are. The one thing I can tell you that is clear, though, for the people who are talking smack uh, with them, you guys don't even know half the story. And if you do, you're just as bad. You're just as bad. All right. Let's 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 break it down. I defended this person once because I thought I had a good judge of character on them. Boy, was I ever wrong. It's pretty much like being Tinkerbell, just needing that validation and attention 24-7. And then I really I personally do not have that experience because I do not really talk too much to different content creators. I think the only other content creator I really talk to in my DMs is Mouse from time to time. But then we talk about Sometimes about solo leveling, sometimes about other games like Metaphor, stuff like that, different uh, different topics. But outside of that, not really. So I not necessarily, I don't know these environments they are in, right? I'm not in those spaces where they talk mad shit to each other or talk about someone else's in a, a bad light. I can't, can't really talk too much about that. But I experienced that back in the day with other games. So that's nothing new to me. <laughs> And I can 100% um, see that happening, but I cannot confirm it myself. Realized once that person decided to leave and then tried to take down everybody with them, including their own community, I was like, this is, this is not a person who's looking out for anybody but themselves. On top of that, when they returned. They oh yeah, that, that, that's something what I wanted to mention. <laughs> this all, and this is where I made the video like about the shitting on community and shitting on a game it went just a little bit too far and i made that video sharing my opinion as you guys know right um but there's one thing i wanted to mention here because i told you about that one person that suddenly had a maxed out account right if you remember <laughs> just <laughs> if you know as soon as nato announced like she's quitting suddenly that other person said also he's quitting why because there was probably no cash flow coming in more to just A10 characters, A10 weapons, because Nether was saying, you know what, I quit. And since I don't need any more gameplay from you, for this game in particular, you're not getting any more packs, something like that. And this person was scared because he's not spending any money on his account. I was like, oh, if I now continue playing the game, people will figure out eventually if I have like only A0 characters and not everything is maxed out something because he started the story of, yo, I am, I spent the money, but didn't. Now that person announced he's quitting. And then like a couple of weeks later, Nato said she's returning. And that other person as well said, oh, I'm returning as well. Coincidence? I don't think so. But yeah, that, that's not about the other person. I just, just wanted to let you know, giving you my, this is, by the way, just my observation, guys. Okay. Letting you know, this is just me, my personal observation. I don't have bad blood with anyone. Okay. This is where probably because I'm German or something, it could come off the wrong way. Just letting you know, for especially for the people who are watching me for the first time right now, I'm just giving you what I observe, right? Because I'm not stupid. I'm seeing things and I understand. They expected everybody to have open arms, comes back and takes over a, a hardworking man's situation and for, back for themselves and doesn't even give a shit about how they feel. You know who I'm talking about. Wait, what? That, that, that's the one I don't get. Doesn't even give a shit about so what, what was hard working it? man. This is not a person who's looking out for anybody but themselves. Okay, and then the person returned. On top of that, when they returned, they expected everybody to have open arms, comes okay. back and takes over a, a hard working man's situation and for, back for themselves and doesn't even give a shit about how they feel. I don't know what he's talking about. I'm legit. Pain, in case you're watching this, maybe you do, maybe you don't. I don't know. Maybe. Um, let me know in the DMs, probably because this is a little bit more personal. Uh, I'm, I'm just curious. 
Because I, I, I can't say anything about this here. I don't know. I don't. Maybe, maybe I'm just misunderstanding something very simple here, but I, I, I'm not getting it now, here. After that, it gets even crazier. Mm -hmm. They go full tilt, right? This person goes full tilt, decides to start talking smack, decides to, you know, say things behind people's backs, decides to start hiring sex offenders and steroid users to promote their guild. Ugh. <laughs> I remember when I heard it, I was like, at first, like, like I had a big question mark on my head, and then I started laughing about it uh, because it's like, you know, like it just came out of nowhere. Sex offenders and what, what steroid abusers? Where does that come from? I cannot even say anything about it because I don't have details, guys. I only talk about the stuff I can talk about. I'm not talking about stuff I don't know. I don't have any knowledge about. So Jeez, I just, I just personally find this specific one funny. At this point, it's just allegations. I don't know. Who knows? Let me know. In case you know, I don't know. Um, because as I told you, I'm not in these kind of circles to uh, know this type of stuff. God, I love that one. And then, and then decides, you know what? Let's talk a little bit more shit about my peers in another video. Hold on, how many more do I have? I gotta make sure this is monetized. I've got two minutes left, guys. Let me, let me keep going here. <laughs> I'm gonna say this, I'm gonna make this very clear, very easy to understand. With no AI voice, without somebody who had quit and come back and all of a sudden has developed an accent. Um... Isn't the new AI voice uh, British? Stop making yourself look stupid. Stop it. We all know. Everybody knows. All right? Everybody knows you don't play your own game. Everybody knows you're looking out for yourself. Everybody knows you quit. You would have stayed out if something else worked for you, but nothing else worked. So where did you go? You came right back, crawling and begging, hoping the community would take you back. I didn't, as I said, I'm not like actively following anyone else. So I cannot talk about the very specifics because I didn't think about it. But yeah, it could be the case because it is for, in general, for a lot of different YouTubers who try to go, for example, switch to a different type of game, right? It doesn't work out for them. So they go back. To the old game because there they're getting the views they're getting their income with their click-through rate and everything so they get enough revenue in this case with Nero, Nero doesn't need the revenue because she has all the revenue herself on the bank account but i guess it's just for the number that, that's probably it, the number uh-uh this is why you're not growing this is why nobody gives a shit. this is why everybody disrespects you behind your back this is why people don't like you if you had taken a second for yourself and maybe had been a little more humble... I wouldn't say no one likes you because I know for a fact there are a lot of people who like Nato. There are a lot of people who like her. It's insane, actually. You just have to look. You just have to click on one of her videos, look at the comments. Definitely for that. He's probably just over-exaggerating. Don't, don't take every word for... <coughs> don't take just every word too seriously. It is just... He's just over-exaggerating a little bit, but I get his point. I get his point. Towards the people around you, your own community, your own peers, this would have been a whole different story. But instead, instead, your ego can't take a few hits. You put yourself in this position. You have people backing you at the start. You're the one that decided to make your own bed and lay in it. It's crazy to me that you think that we... As content creators give a shit the fact that you think that we're silly for doing eight minute videos you know why i love doing long videos because i'm giving myself to my community i'm giving a part of me to them i promote myself as i mean pen can say whatever he wants with with that specific case it's absolutely fine like he's defending himself at this point it's completely fine what he's saying at this moment at the end of the day he has to do the eight minutes for a maximum revenue gain on his channel. And it's completely fine, you know? Who cares? Everybody does it. I don't see a bad thing with it. For me, currently, I'm not doing it. Or the only reason I'm doing longer format videos, like I'm trying to get above eight minutes, is <clears throat> I feel like if, my, if the videos are longer, they get like better boosts from the algorithm, something like that. But by the way, I'm not monetizing my videos. As I said in the last one I made, um, where I shared my opinion, I'm not monetizing my videos, so I can could make two minute videos. It doesn't really matter for me or twenty minute videos because I'm not getting a single penny right now from doing YouTube. Okay, 
So that's from my side. As much as I promote the game, people know me. People know my life. I'm not. Oh yeah, and he did do a lot of promotion. I remember because Pain I watched back in the days when I played Final Fantasy Ever Crisis. I started. I was looking on on YouTube like content creators, and I think this is where I found Pain. I think it was Ever Crisis something because I watched a couple of his videos just to understand a couple of things here and there. Um, but I remember when he started, like, so for example, he's what, 77k subscribers right now. When he started doing solo leveling, I think he had 29k. He didn't have more. The, he had, he gained a crazy, 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 crazy boost with solo leveling arise. Like, solo leveling arise is Pain's breakout game. Um, because before that he had less than 30k, I'm 100% sure. Now he's like almost at 80k, rolled to 100k. Um well deserved and he's grinding dude he's like posting three four videos a day i'm like dude i, I i'm happy if i upload like three videos per week okay <laughs> afraid of that i have nothing to hide but for you we still don't know who you are you keep wearing that mask and eventually no one's gonna care you're just gonna disappear with that mask and no one's gonna give a fuck that you even existed in the past stop talking smack be real Remember, you're not that important. And before I go, one last thing. The game's asking you a very important question. Why don't you do us all a favor and just quit again? All right. <laughs> well, big mic drop at the end from Painblad. <coughs> Let's see how Neto responded. No. Dude, I, oh, dude, you always have to search Nato solo leveling arise because you always get this here. You always get this. Guys, you see the struggle? <coughs> <coughs> Don't forget to leave a like on this video. <clears throat> Where's the response video? There was a response video. So yeah, Nato took off the reaction. Um, so... <laughs> That was my plan. I didn't know. I said I didn't know. The only thing I can say, like my last finishing words is, guys, just stop the beef. I'm not asking for anyone to shake hands because that's not expecting. Because I know for a fact, I know myself, if someone is talking smack about me and like, it's like that, you know, just try to backstep you more or less. I know also I would never shake someone's hands in that regards. But you know, just make a cut just agree that you disagree, move on, and just don't talk about each other anymore. In that sense, you know what I mean? Don't talk smack. Yo, I, I'm, just, I'm talking to you too directly now. Pain, no need for you to talk about Nato. And Nato, just don't talk smack about Pain or anyone else as well, okay? It's childish. It's nothing. I know he was just trying to defend himself at this point because it was enough for him, but I'm just telling you, move on chill out i don't understand why you have to beef all the time guys I, literally i i don't understand why you all need to do stuff like that really can you just work on yourself help the people stop this annoying bullshit just be real guys seriously just just be real just be yourself be honest and that's what people appreciate the most be yourself Thanks guys for watching. See you with the next one. Deuces.